Hori Split Pack Compact for Nintendo Switch. Let's jump right into this. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Thank you for stopping by. In today's video, we're going to be checking out the Split Pad Compact by Hori. Now this is a Nintendo Switch Joy-Con replacement, except for it lacks some of the features that your typical Joy-Con has, like vibration and the motion sense controls. But other than that, this is meant to be used in handheld mode and it's supposed to be a little more ergonomical than the Nintendo Switch Joy-Cons that come with the Switch. So without further ado, let's just go around the package and then open this thing up. So as you see, it says ergonomic controller for handheld mode. And then on the back, we have things like extra grip for the perfect fit. And we'll be testing that out just to make sure. Not that I don't trust the box, but you know, it has programmable rear triggers, precision D-pad, and full-size shoulder buttons. So let's go ahead and grab an unboxing knife and open this up. Box and knife should be an easy cut. And well, I don't think we had to cut the bottom, but might as well just for safe measures. That should do it. Side note, shout out to everybody rocking with the channel. Thanks for all the new subs and definitely appreciate the OG subs. You guys make the channel what it is. So let's see what this Hori Split Pad Compact is all about. And of course I got it in the apricot red color. This controller comes, or this Split Pad comes in three different colors I believe. Um, and I just chose the the red one, you know, that's my favorite color. So might as well keep it simple Nothing else in the box Pretty simple You have the split pads Let's see wow, this is a thick <laughs> Instruction manual. I wasn't expecting that Hope this doesn't mean I have to read all this, but I suggest you guys reading this. We'll toss this to the side Let's pop one of these out Oh yeah, this definitely is much bigger than the original Joy-Cons that come with the Switch. And off of first impressions, I kind of like it. I mean, the buttons, they, they have a little bit of a plasticky feel, but I think that after playing with these for a while, you'll get used to that and it, and it shouldn't interrupt gaming. The thumbstick feels really nice. And it does, if you can guys can see this, it has a little bit of texture and grip to it. So I'm definitely loving that. Looks like you have a turbo button and an assign button. On the back, you have that FR button, which you can remap this button here. Triggers feel kind of basic, but if I'm being honest, they feel better than the triggers on the original Joy-Cons. So that's already a win. As you can hear, it has a click to it. So let's go ahead and take this other one out. It says Hori at the top. And it looks like there's another assign and turbo button on the left side as well. So. All right, let's go ahead and pop these Joy-Cons off and get down to business. Why wait? Nice fit. And just like that, I really like the look. This gives my Nintendo Switch a whole different look in it. And I'm feeling this right here. So let's power this thing on and then just test it out. So as you guys see, I was playing a little Pokemon I know, nerd, right? Look at that. Update right during the video. So after this updates, guys, I'll, I'll come right All back. Right. All right, guys, the update completed and we're back. Before we get into some gaming, I just wanted to say, I like the look and feel of this Hori Split Pack Compact. 
it does feel a little plasticky, but that's not something that would prevent you from having a good time using this while gaming. So let's go ahead and jump into some Rocket League and test out exactly how responsive the controls are. And please forgive me, I'm not the best at Rocket League. I do all right. Anybody want to get down to some Rocket League, let me know, drop a comment, and I'll find you. So far, everything's pretty responsive. Let's try some boost here. Yeah. I'm not noticing any kind of lag or anything. However, there's no vibration or anything you would expect from like the Nintendo Switch Joy-Cons. So that might be a downside. No vibration, no motion sense or anything like that. So you couldn't take the this uh, split pad apart and then start using it that way. You, you need it directly connected to the Nintendo Switch. Come on, let me do something good for the channel. Did I say I wasn't the best at Rocket League? I said that, right? That was nice, though. All right, I got this, guys. I got this. I'm doing it for you. Come on, come on. I hate to steal the shine. I totally robbed that guy, and he was going to make it. But you guys get the picture. Split pack compact by Hori. So far, is a go. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. I'm going to try to score some. Wait, wait. This could be it. This could be it. Let's go. And what a way to end the video. <laughs> All right, guys. I'll catch you in the next one. <laughs> Peace.